And did you win the race? Yeah, 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 I won the race, yeah. Hold on, man. So the Rockstex 2 is redefining what high performance road running footwear is about. Uh, the Rockstex 2 for Hoka represents the top of the range experience that you can find uh, with maximum rebound performance while uh, still maintaining excellent properties of stability and overall a well-rounded high performance shoe. It would have been really easy to kind of say, let's just update the Rocket X1, make a couple little tweaks, you know, shimmy some stuff around and feel good. Uh, but it gave us permission to feel like we don't need to stop there. We can do more testing. We can always get more athlete feedback. We can always get more internal feedback. We can always listen to consumers better. And it was a great reminder for us that that is where we will thrive and continue to be really innovative is by constantly mining for those data points. Uh, we normally use when uh, we're doing like a fast workout and sometimes like on the track or on the road, you know, uh, just like fast workout, long a little bit. There's, uh, you know, quite a difference because you know, on Rocket X2 you recover so fast because it's just like after more cushion and uh, the carbon on it and just amazing. There's uh, actually quite a lot of examples of athletes that I can think of that uh, we've collected feedback from and, and tested that shoe with that uh, yeah, have shared some uh, some really cool feedback and something that, that felt amazing, whether it was Steph Bruce and running Boston last year, Ali Finn and crushing it in her marathon season. So to be able to have that early feedback and confirmation that, yeah, it feels lively, it feels energetic, it feels bouncy, it feels hoka, uh, was just really affirming that we were on the right direction. Ultimately, the goal, I think, of a great racing shoe is you don't even feel it on race day. So for us, making sure we're taking away any of those details that might feel a little fussy and making sure it just feels like it's there to support you, but but not there to bother you. I mean, I'm no shoe expert, but it's a very responsive shoe and it definitely helps to kind of propel you forwards, which is never a bad thing, but I just can't resist wearing them for every session. <laughs> Starting with the upper, it has a, a minimalist, yes, strategically padded upper that enables to keep the weight to a minimum and uh, really hold your foot in a very precise and secured way where it matters. We uh, introduced a full new foam compound uh, that, uh, that we've been working on for a while that uses supercritical technology and uh, some thermoplastic polymers, including some, some PIBA, that, uh, that foam set up together with the uh, composite uh, plate that is embedded in the middle is what makes that uh, that bottom unit extremely exciting. It's been awesome so far. Like, yeah, there's just the, the way the shoe is made is like really cushioned and feels really good on my feet. Uh, makes me fast and has like that rocker feeling like where it propels me forward. And I don't feel like I'm wasting energy or if I'm slowing down in my uh, workouts, I feel like I'm, you know, still hitting the pace and just Makes me feel fast, you know? It makes me feel super. We also know that, hey, this experience works great for an elite, but we also want to make sure that us, us humans, us three to four hour plus marathoners, can also feel just as fast. There's, there's something that feels uh, great about seeing, uh, seeing people, seeing wonderful persons, wonderful athletes perform at their best with product that we put work into. Because at the end of the day, that's really the, the, the end goal and the purpose is to make people happy by doing something that they love.